Okay, hey, it's uh, Carl and Liam here from PresentationExpressions.com. Here is the first of our tutorials for present uh, for not presentations for PowerPoint. Okay? That's right, that's right. So what we um, I believe what we're going to show everybody today, Carl, is how to choose a template and how to save it. Okay, excellent. That's simple. Okay, okay, that's simple. All right, so how do you choose a template? You can see there, there's a screen. Now, this is on PowerPoint for Mac, but it's pretty much the exact same thing mm -hmm. as PowerPoint on uh, Windows computer. So at the top here, you're actually going to see something that says uh, slide themes. Okay, right. really easy. In uh, PowerPoint for Microsoft for Windows, uh, they call this the ribbon area. So you're going to see when you click on it, it'll open up all these fancy looking uh, themes here. Okay. Right. So what do you, what do we do after that, Liam? Well, we've just simply got to choose one. Okay. Haven't we? <laughs> I, I, I guess you know. Okay. And, and just a small point on the templates, you know, yeah. make sure it's an appropriate template for your presentation, of course. Uh, yeah, right. Um, it's really easy to find templates mm -hmm. that really just don't work. So uh, my advice um, is simple is better. What, what what's your advice on that? I would absolutely go along with that. Simple is better. Okay, so let's choose a simple one. Let's just say I don't know. This one here looks simple. So all you do, click on it, and done. That's okay, it. that's yeah. it. That's all you have to do. So if you're going to just change the title, okay, we'll talk more about making these look better. And we have talked about them in some of our own tutorials. That's but right. What do you want right. to What do you want to say here? Um, well, why don't we just say, uh, okay, let's just say PowerPoint tutorial. Power. Point. Power. Point. Okay. Uh, tutorial, and that's it. So that's what do we it. do to save it now, Liam? Okay. Well, uh, we have to click save. I click guess save. So. Hey, well, yeah, okay, someone's, someone's paying attention, all right. Yeah. So here's save up here, save this presentation. Mm -hmm. Simply click on that, and up you want. Mm -hmm. And now, here actually is a very interesting thing. Um, do you know about this here, Liam? Oh, the PPTX thing? Yeah. Okay, I know it can cause problems actually, can't it, sometimes? It's yeah. Later, yeah, yeah. So the best thing to do is just to make it PPT. Right. Okay. Uh, X is for the new version of Office, and sometimes people can't open those. So that's right. So if you're sending this to anybody, they might have a problem opening right. it. Right. So PPT is the best, and then all you gotta do after that is just click on Save, and you're done. That's it. Okay. And and also just just before you click Save, there, Carl. Um, also, um, if if you want, to make sure you choose the place on your computer that you can remember. Right. 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 So set up your file system <laughs> properly so that you can find it easily. Okay. Right. Okay, good advice there. So uh, that pretty much is it for the tutorial. Um, you want to just wrap up everything and just sort of summarize what we just talked about? Yeah, so, so today, remember, we talked about the template. Yes. Or how to choose a template, yep. I'm sorry. Yep. Um, both of us advise a nice, simple template. Don't complicate it. Yep. And just simply then save in. Right, save saving it. it. Yeah. And I would suggest actually saving to desktop. Okay, okay, good. And that's right. it, really. That's it. Okay, very good. Thank you for joining us here at PresentationExpressions.com. We'll be back again with another tutorial, uh, hopefully sometime soon. All right. I hope so. Okay, Take thanks care. a lot.